it never occurred. It, funny enough, it never occurred to me that it was a dance record. And you know that sounds absurd now, but I wasn't thinking about a dance record. I was thinking about at the front, you know, where where it started. I imagined that uh, armies of people stretching out to the horizon, want, waiting to have sex, <laughs> <laughs> and Holly being the sort of uh, standing like on 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 the top of a tower and a minaret, like a minaret with minarets calling the faithful to come and fuck, basically. Um, well, it's it's basically the reaction <laughs> that the, the Thatcher government had towards the track as well, right? Yes. <laughs> yeah, well, people got very angry about it. But I, I thought all of this was in my head, right? And that, that we would be okay. Um, anyway, I remember the singers arrived because the band were up in Liverpool and Holly and Paul, who were the two singers, arrived at the studio at about 11 o'clock that night. And I told the reception when Holly gets here, to keep them down there. Don't let them come up to the studio. And <laughs> anyway, they phoned me at 11 o'clock. I said, Holly and Paul are here. So I went downstairs. And uh, and they, of course, they said, how's it going? And I said, well, it, it, it's changed a bit. And they said, changed? How much has it changed? I said, well, it's changed quite a lot, actually. He said, oh, no, you haven't started again, have you? Because you can remember this is the fourth time. I said, yeah, <laughs> I've started again, sorry. And they ran, and I ran after them. They ran up to the studio. And, of course, we, we played it. And from the minute it started, they started to dance, and they loved it. 